Hey guys, Dylan here. The light came on just before I turned the camera on, and I like to observe them when they're down here on the rocks, and, uh, you know, just after the light comes on, because it's bizarre, you don't always see them kind of all hanging in the rocks. But they're down here before they, uh, get kicked out by, uh, Mr. Man, who starts to wake up. But just after the light comes on, they're all on the substrate and we'll slowly see them all get kicked out right now who's down here oh, someone's getting kicked out oh it's tug look at it's tugging mr. man he's trying to take his home look at this tugs never in that spot and they never go head to head like this either. Look at this. Well, he gave up. Tug got out of there. Tug knows it's not his spot. Now it's on. Look at the little red top down here colored up. Yep, now they're all up in the water. They just have to piss the dominant off enough to go after the second. And now they're all out of the rocks. I don't think anybody else is down here hiding. They're all up here now. But that's what happens when the light comes on. Usually they're all in these rocks. And it takes them, you know, a couple of minutes to, to acclimate to the light and uh, kind of come out. But look, he's pissed. He's pissed because Tug wouldn't get out of his hole very quick. And they battled for a little bit. Oh, he's taken to the high ground now. I'm surprised this little red top, he's still trying to get down there. Usually this guy's heads right up to the back of the filter and hides. One of the tiniest guys in the tank. Actually, he's a little bigger than shark bait now, which is cool. You're starting to see some color. Uh, you'll see his bars, and uh, he's looking really good if he'll come out from behind those rocks. It's funny that he's trying to get down here. He knows he doesn't belong down here. He'll get kicked out soon enough if they don't notice him. Look at shark bait down here too. It's very surprising to see these little tiny fish on the substrate. This is just not their area. Oh, look at him. He's looking great right now. Good morning. He was so tiny. If you remember when I first put him in this tank, he certainly did not belong in here with all these big dogs. But he has just grown up just fine. He's done well. And look at him. He's in like... He's in Dad's chair. It's like, you better get out of there. See how you can see down to glass? It's pretty much because the Sacolify has dug out that hole and I haven't filled it in. I've kind of just let it be. It's kind of surprising that this guy's getting away with hanging out in there for some time. The Demason Eye hasn't chased him off. Hey, look at this guy. The Demason Eye usually goes after the red top. Ooh, look at that color. Oh, this guy's a brute today. Look at him. Oh, that's great. He is not taking it from the Demason eye anymore. That is awesome. He's got size on him, that's why. Oh, that is fantastic. Look at those colors. No wonder why he's down here. He's trying to gain some residence. But not from you, dude. You can't mess with this guy. Well, this guy. And for a while, you couldn't really mess with this guy. But I guess he's kind of too tiny now. He just, uh, being a dwarf in Boona, he just doesn't measure up to the big dogs. How's Wally looking today? Wally looks great always, just because of that great orange dorsal fin and his cool blue and... You don't often see him nicked up because he stays out of trouble for the most part, but look at this red top. Boy, is he coloring up today. That's going to be cool. He's going to be gray in here once I uh, get some size on him. How's the Rusty doing? I notice the Rusty kind of goes after the red top sometimes.
Well, that's going to be a look at the Ambuna for the AM, guys. Like I said, the, the light just came on. It's, like, it's good to see their reaction, you know. Coming out of the rocks. Look at this. He is not putting up with the Mason Eye. He's got some size on him, that's why. And that's good. That's okay. If I can see that color come out just because he wants to tangle with the Demason eye, so be it. Look at him. <sighs> yup. You are awesome looking, dude. Been waiting for this fish to really show decent color. Ha ha ha, look at that. He wants to be down here though. I mean this is not a good spot for you. This is where. The Sokolify lives, man. The Demason is gonna continue battling with him because he holds down the, the rockscape. And uh, if the Red Top thinks it's gonna be in the rockscape, it's just gonna have to battle with the Aratus and, you know, all the other big dogs. So I think that's just kind of a, a circumstantial thing. He's trying to gain a little spot. And he knows that the Demason Eye is pretty much tolerated down here on the substrate. But I don't think he'll last down here very long. Who's in this hole? Oh, the Aratus. Alright guys, that's gonna be my Mbuna AM. Totally appreciate you guys hanging out. Haven't done an update in some time, so I thought I'd give you a look at them in the morning time. He's gonna start his regulating right now. Alright, you guys have a good one. Peace.